Smoke a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. Y'all know what the fuck we doing, man. It's Hot Thoughts TV. Niggas hot in the beach, man. I'm smoking a purse so sweet with Hot Thoughts TV. But shit, nigga can't even get shit. Know what I'm saying? You know I got ep epilepsy, so I can't. Now I don't even let a nigga drive. You know what I'm really? saying, yo. So being uh, diagnosed with that, what? how has life, you know, how have you experienced life differently or how has it affected you? I mean, shit, I'm straight. I just smoke weed. Like, that's, that will help the nigga, you feel me? Like, I don't take medication for this shit, bro. Like, that shit be fucking me up, bro. So I just smoke, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, um, all through high school, I was having seizures and shit. And, you know, the only thing I couldn't do was play sports, you know what I'm saying? And drive, you know what I'm saying? So, shit, other than that, I was cool. Like, I just can't play sports no more. Yeah. yeah. So talk the name Kidnap the Money. Uh, where is that? Cause I know that there's a there's a few other members that I, I you know spoke with before. Where exactly did the name come from, or just the collective in general? PJ, big bro, big bro came up with this. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. Tired of the guy. And how did that, like, how did you come in contact with them or him? Man, that's no my, no my people. Train PJ, my cousins. You know what I'm saying? We grew up together at my grandma's house. You know what I'm saying? Like, all of us, me, Taylor, Dion, Chris, Trey, PJ, we all grew up at my granny house. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, bro came with this shit before he died. And you know, I'm the little brother, so she, you feel me? I'm the youngest, so she, I'm with whatever they with. You know what I'm saying? So she, I'm ripping this shit harder than anybody. You feel me? Yeah. So she, it's and, just like that. And so, as far as the, the turtle aspect of it, what is that? What's like the deeper meaning of that? Or where's the significance from the turtles? Man, from? we just fucked with the Ninja Turtles, dog. Oh. <laughs> 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 That's really all it was. We just fucked with the Ninja Turtles, dog. Tough. You know what I'm saying? Like, nigga, Ninja Turtle, Dragon Ball Z, all this shit. That's all we used to watch. You know what I'm saying? Like, just some young niggas. Just chilling this shit. So, we just made that shit gangster, dog. That's the only thing. We just made that shit gangster. You know what I'm saying? So, growing up, like, to, to, I guess, learn or just absorb the traits of what makes a gangster, what would you say? Because it's a lot of, I feel like, especially in music, it's a lot of people that get that aspect of life Yo. and they might not have the real definition, Man. per se. What's your, what's your uh, definition of what makes someone, uh, uh, you know, a gangster, a street nigga, or, or that? I ain't gonna lie. My definition of gangster, it ain't just street nigga, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's about loyalty, respect. You gotta have honor. You gotta have something to take pride in. You feel me? Meaning your family. You know what I'm saying? Who you be around, where you from. You don't take pride in that, bro. You, you know what I'm saying? Like, you feel me? But like being gangster is having responsibilities. You know what I'm saying? If you know these people look up to you, you lead them, you got them, you show them shit. You know what I'm saying? You show these niggas it's more to life outside the hood. And a lot of niggas don't do that shit. That's why I can't respect that gangster. They crash niggas out. You feel me? You ain't supposed to crash out a young nigga, bro. You know what I'm saying? Put them on some money, teach them some shit. But, you know, people look at shit different. So, you know, like, um, watching them all movies and shit, like The Godfather, family, you feel me? Honor. Them niggas took pride in being that man's son. You feel me? Like, you know what I'm saying? So, that's just that. Like, uh, and that's how we was raised. Like, I grew up looking at my papa. To me, I know about more gangster than that man. That man handled his responsibilities as the man of the family. You feel me? Like, that's some gangsta ass shit. Fuck that slide and shit. Like, I could care less about this shit. That shit I ain't gangsta. I know white niggas that's gangsta. More gangster than any nigga in the streets, you feel me? Never even 
shot a nigga before, you feel me? Like, I swear to God, I'm some, I'm some real gangster shit, you feel me? Like, but niggas don't see that point of view. Know what I'm saying? They look at guns and all this shit like, bro, that shit just, know what I'm saying? Like, this shit ain't gangster, bro. You know what I'm saying? But you do got some niggas that be in the street doing you know, some gangsta ass shit when they come down to this shit though. I ain't gonna lie. Know what I'm saying? So, but it's two ways to look at it. But that's my point of view on what gangsta is. Like, you have no business as a man, bro. Even, you can be a female and be a gangsta shit. Know what I'm saying? Like, lay on my tea like this shit right for kids by herself. Gangsta. You feel me? I swear to God. So, yeah, that's some gangsta shit.